This is Chad Warner, founder of Optimize. I'd like to give you a brief tour of our website, which we redesigned at the beginning of 2016. So here we're looking at the home page. We've got kind of an intro and hero area, what we do, our featured work, reasons to go with Optimize, call to action, and the footer. Then in the portfolio, we have a sample of some of the sites that we've created. Click on any of these to see more. This area here could be images or videos, um, anything that's kind of showing off the site, a description about it, links to the live site, a testimonial. Services page gives an overview of our services, which uh, with links out to those individual service pages. The About page tells more about us and the team. The blog includes um, tips, resources, uh, information about WordPress and web design. Uh, so you can search here. You can also jump straight to a particular category here or view all of them. and then you can also contact us. So let's look behind the scenes at how some of this is done. So I'm going to slide over to the WordPress admin area here and let's look at testimonials. So this is how that page looks on the front end. You've got um, pictures, names, organizations, testimonials arranged like this. So in the back end we've got um, the various testimonials arranged here you can edit. And so this is a nice interface that um, we've set up to allow us to manage these testimonials. Name, organization, link out to their website, the testimonial, their image. So that works well there. Um, the portfolio, which we click through here. So if we go look at this again, this is how it looks on the front end. And on the back end, So we've got the name of the project, the description, the featured image, which is what shows up on the portfolio page. And then there's a section here where we can set up a slider, which is controlled separately. Um, and that's where we can put in images or videos. And then we can actually um, relate a testimonial to this project. So we can see our available testimonials here, select from the list, and it will then connect that testimonial with this project. So we're using custom fields, uh, for example, for the projects. We have project details, which is how we control the slider, the external link, the testimonial. So that's what sets up um, the fields within the testimonial. So as we sit down here, these project details, slider, external link, testimonial. So those are constructed here. And we have the same thing for testimonials. Testimonial details are set up there. We also use something called post snippets, which allows us to take blocks of uh, usually HTML and um, turn it into a, a simple short code. Um, so as an example of, of how we use this, um, this is looking at our services page. Um, so just to jump back to that here. So we've got this text block up at the top, and then we've got icons, and these are arranged in a certain way with, with columns. Um, and so this is set up with a, a variety of different short codes, and you can kind of see these here. Um, so this is a really nice way of working with the content of this page right within the WordPress editor um, and gives us a nice result like this. And then we also created a theme guide, and this is for our own internal use, um, just so that we can see, uh, I'm going to switch over to text here, so you can see kind of how to use some of the different styling, um, whether those are snippets or, or certain markup. Um, and if we preview this, we can get kind of an idea for what this shows. So this shows how it would actually render on the front end 
um, with all the icons and special formatting and everything. So this is something that we can reference in the future uh, so that we can kind of keep all the, all the formatting nice. To learn more about this and other websites, please visit us at optimize.com.